Mine's right. Hmm, that can't be right. Oh, but what if they're real after all? No, that can't be. Greetings, miss! Is there something that's bothering you? Oh, no, it's nothing. I'm Della Roche, the rep... Oh, so you're adventurers! Paimon can tell you were really bothered by something. Don't worry, you've got two... Oh, you are exactly the helpers I need. See, the problem is that the fish are... They disappeared too quickly for it to have been the work of human anglers. <clears throat> right, but unfortunately... So you'd like us to... Exactly, you're right, on the Mora. So I thought I could delegate this work to you. Are you two some kind of... Yeah, we're just really... Uh, well, I'm glad to hear it. But don't we just need to investigate the... No, you mustn't let your guard down. As the representative of the Fishing Association... Yes, you're both outlanders, right? Our local... F the story our parents would tell us was always the same. A child eating water imp? My father would always describe it as a beautiful, multicolored snake woman. While my... M Even though the tales vary regarding its appearance... Everyone agrees that it's really dangerous. It, and once it finds a child, it uses its alluring singing voice. Uh, sounds kind of scary. But what if the fairy tale was inspired by... Well, I wouldn't call it evidence, per se, but I've heard some rumors lately. They say that someone re... So you mean someone really... It's all hearsay, so it's hard to confirm. But still, both the Opera House and the Fountain of Lucene were built there, and the sources of many water veins can be traced to the island as well. Combine that with... Is it really so shocking that an island so shroud... Ah! feel like you're pulling our leg. You're just piling on the rumors now. Oh, marvelous. Then I'll just mark the stretch of water on your map.
job. Phew. Go! Is this the stretch of water Delarosh was talking about? It looks really peaceful. Huh? These look pretty fresh. Oh, did the water imp get someone again? Let's look around and see if we can... Oh, wait! Did you hear something just... Paimon? Traveler? Uh, I'm so... I think our situations are probably unsure if that I know the name because of one of my employers. She noticed the clockwork penguins I brought to the workshop and contacted me through the shop's owner. Following her request... Huh? But isn't it a little creepy to name a toy? Yeah, but, uh... She made a... It's alright, though. She'll be coming over to check on my progress shortly, and I'll just... Huh. Cold and reserved sometimes, you're still really considerate. Our target is the fish. Ah, these past few weeks, I've been taking Thelxy for underwater tests, so all the. Ah! So that's all it was? That actually makes a lot of sense. Yes, I think that's quite. <sighs> I'm sorry. It sounds like I've created a lot of trouble for everyone else as well. Thank you. Actually, how much work do you still have left, Remini? Uh, thanks for offering. Hey, it's no trouble at all! But... don't you need to report back to your commissioner? Nope, that's not how it works. See, Paimon's got these commissioners. If we tell them now that it was all just a misunderstanding, you can bet that... Exactly! So if we can help you finish up your work and get the fish back... Um... Is that what... Huh. Or... I've stored Thelxy in the tent. He can respond to some simple verbal commands. You can try calling his name and see if he'll come over. Whoa! Sounds pretty advanced! Let Paimon give it a try! So that's Fremenet's version of Thelxy. Yep. Had Thelxy lived in Penguin Town, he'd... Uh, it's not really anywhere famous or important. Hey, Thelxy. Nice to meet you. Do I wanted to install a language output module. As it stands, Thelxy can only output messages that were pre-written into its motherboard. I haven't given... No, there's... I have two other things I'd like your help with. The first is to do some integration testing on Thelxy's motherboard. That doesn't... The other shouldn't take too long either. 
You'll need to find- A weapon? Mm -hmm. Thelxy will need to be able to charge fo- What an imaginative employer! Naming Thelxy after a- Well, regardless of his role or species- Whoa! Thelxy just said something again! He can react to certain key words, but unfortunately- That's a pity. But anyway, the most important thing right now is for us to get to work! Sounds good. The motherboard- Ah, here we go. I have this testing manual, so if you want to give it a try, it's okay if you don't six. Okay, no. You're doing We've taken on a lot of similar t Then let's move on to the underwater part. It's just oh speaking of which, you're both okay. That's good. be able to find something that'll help us with our search. This is it. We call this thing an echoing conch. It can detect special reflection waves in the wall. Did you notice any interesting places? The echoing conch should have detected some just now. Let's go check them out. head back to camp. Uh, thank you for staying out here with me all this time.
You're back. I thought you... I'm sorry, Madame Destray. I must... There's no rush. I'm your... Oh, uh, they're two of my trustworthy... Yes, I see. I suppose it's all... It's really nice to meet you, Madame Destray. Are you from... Greetings, my new friends. Just call me Zoria. You are both so adorable. The... Oh, do you really think so? Of course. If my child had friends like you... Then perhaps... Obsessed with... Ah, oh, so you don't know anything about my request? Well, Fremenet told us that it was a private matter, so we... I see. So Monsieur Fremenet is even more discreet than I had thought. Hmm. But it would be quite impolite of me to simply pile all of my troubles on you without your permission. Sure, you can tell us anything. You've already said nice things about us, so we'll try our best to help you... Ah, oh, what a lovely little fairy. Then let me think of a way to... Simply put, parents came up with a story. Painting water imps as scary abductors in an effort to... Con in... infatuate? Yes. He told me that he thought the water imp might have just been misunderstood. In his mind, instead... Huh. So he wanted to become friends with the water imp so it wouldn't... <laughs> Thank you, little Paimon. He indeed has always stood up. Mm -hmm. It's a type of mental disorder. Those affected by it often feel extremely- Oh no! Mm. If you were to become afflicted with the disorder, Paimon- No! Paimon won't accept that! We would have to find a doctor to help cure Paimon! Paimon has a 2,000 word quota for daily cover- The family doctor has already begun to treat my son. But since the disorder is rare, there aren't many good regimens for treatment- Huh? Uncon- Uncontrollable delusions. To put- Then- then what is he s It's a dream that he often mentioned to me when he was younger. I've- Amazing! Your son came up with all of this? But perhaps no beautiful dream can ever last long. Well, it'd be more accurate to say that it was the syndrome that caused such terrible delusions to manifest. My poor child can no longer differentiate between imag- Um, perhaps in his mind, the lonely- What? So that's what you meant by uncontrolled- Alas, most of the time he acts as if he can no longer sense or interact with the real world at all. I've had- He once wanted to make a picture book of his imaginary world. But since the disorder progressed too quickly, he never quite got... Ah! So Zuri's son also saw Felxie as a pain. What we should do now is help him complete this picture book. We'll need to chase away his loneliness and sorrow, and let him perceive a world full of hope again. But if we just need to finish the picture book, why does Fremenet need to make... Because we need to treat the book's story seriously, as if it's a history of things that have really happened. We'll need to, but my child can no longer go on a journey of his own. This is why... I... Ah, like a stand-in for your son! Paimon's starting to get it now! Oh, he... There are some ruins on the seabed of the Salacia Plains. I've already asked Fremenet to research them for me. Oh, so we'll just need to act out a performance of, uh... 
Oh, a brave journey to... Sadly, no. We won't just be putting on a performance. It's just as... Uh, so we'll be playing it straight? Or, uh, making it a... It's all right. There's no need to get that serious. It's not a big deal. I but <sighs> Keep your spirits up, everyone. If we were to look troubled, my son is sure to become anxious. We temporarily moved to a place on the hill over there, so my son will have a better spot to convalesce. It's not far from the water and there- Understood. There's also one last thing. That's great news. I must thank you all. Hmm. With all right, everyone. Zeria sure is a brave and optimistic lady. Uh, let's discuss that over by the tent. Girl, Billy, Cheryl, silly bi What is it from an- <clears throat> Um... This is the first time that you've met anyone with the syndrome, right? If things don't quite turn out as we wish... Fremine, why do you bring this up all of a sudden? Didn't we just promise- It's not that I'm not optimistic. Ah, so that's why you looked like you knew exactly what she was talking about. No, no. Please don't misunderstand. I've- They say there are many factors surrounding the development of this illness. I've heard everything from hereditary factors and what- And from the cases I've seen, there weren't many positive outcomes. What? It could get that serious? And you're- <sighs> Yeah, that's just the nature of it. So if you'll find it difficult to cope with the- Yeah, that's right! Paimon's- Really? <sighs> yeah! Uh, but Paimon has a question. If this illness... After all, we'll just be using a toy as Thelxie, and some ruins as the Kingdom of Water... Well... I think it should be able to do something. To harbor a fantasy means that the child... But if we can help him regain control and escape from the darkness, we'll be able to change... Oh, Paimon sees what you're saying now. Hmm... Well, maybe because I have also had many of my own dreams in the past. I even had my own fi- Ah! <sighs> what Penguin Town? Why does a Paimon remember? Is that a- Hey! Why did you put- <clears throat> It's just- Anyway, Penguin Town is a peaceful place, and Pear is the town- Pear? But didn't you- Well... I often think that Pear only came to me because he realized how- Uh... Femine... No, I don't think so. I can still differentiate between- It might just be hidden, which is why it's difficult- Specific times? What? Yeah. Really? Pyra just said that because you put on your helmet- Have you ever observed the surface world from underwater? It's as if you're viewing a whole different world. I have a similar feeling when I put on my diving helmet. In those... Really? Like a miracle? Well, if that's in order. Hey, don't you still need time to work on Thugsy's weapon? We don't... Right. I still have to collect some tools I'll need to craft the weapon. I've got to finish every... Thanks for all of your help. I'll...
Thank you. 